Hi guys, my name is Ntlantla, known as Ntlantla1802 on Instagram. Born in Joburg, raised in Pitori, I'm a photographer, sneaker lover, I'm studying graphic design, and yeah, let's get it. Uh, my love for photography began when I was out with my friend and he took a photo of me and it was raining that day and there was lightning in that photo. So it intrigued me because I was like, whoa, dude, how did you do that? And I just fell in love from that day, went home, taught myself. I didn't have a camera at the time. I had a phone and I used that phone to just play around with what I could play around with and then it just fell into place you know on Instagram I just started posting photos and people just fell in love I guess and I'm here now <laughs> so I'm more of a portrait lifestyle photographer and like I said before I love sneakers and streetwear so that is what I gravitate more towards like especially these past few years um, with the people that I've been shooting and the brands that I've been working with, you know. Um, streetwear photography has been like, yeah, something that I love, especially because I grew up loving sneakers, you know, and sneakers is a thing at home. So as soon as I got a camera, I, that was the first thing I gravitated um, towards shooting. And ever since then, I've just been shooting like uh, fashion, lifestyle, a bit of sneakers here and there. I also love cars. I've been trying to uh, get into that a little bit more because it's, I feel like you, you have a lot of creative freedom when it comes to cars because there's no input from a person unless you're shooting for someone specifically. But cars are also like what I love shooting because it's just you and the subject. And then with people, I also love shooting people because you can tell a story, you know? I'm inspired by a lot of streetwear and a lot of uh, brands overseas like Hypebeast, um, High Snobiety, they post a whole lot of content that I would like to see myself creating one day. So today we're shooting the Jack Lemkus Winter Collection. Um, we had a young shoot with the bros over there and I found it very dope because of the pieces that they gave us. Um, it was a pink sweater and a yellowish kind of faded um, t-shirt so how i went about shooting that was looking for a vibe that would capture you know that would uh, best suit those pieces and with the yellow t-shirt we first um, walked around uh, Maboneng and we saw some sort of like greenery and art pieces so we i went around uh, i went about shooting around that kind of vibe and you'll see the photos they were quite dope in my opinion because the colors that i found complement each other you know and with the outfit that my bro had it played a very um dope you know it was a very dope scene and then with the pink sweater i went to a construction site kind of vibe but then the lighting wasn't the way i wanted it to be so i ditched that idea and we found a dope restaurant whereby my bro could chill so it kind of looked like you know how yeah how it was dressed it was like casual just chinos and the pink sweater and it went very well in my opinion because the colors you know they were communicating, yeah. <laughs> to sum it all up, where I'd like to see myself in the next five to ten years, first of all, I'd like to graduate. I'm studying graphic design and feel like my qualification will help me reach where I want to reach, which is working for an agency or magazine like Hypebeast. And like I said, I would love to see that happen here in South Africa um, because I feel like we have everything that we need. You know, we don't always have to look at what's happening overseas. We can do that ourselves. And with the way that social media and the internet is playing a part in what we do in our daily lives, I feel like we are very close to achieving that. And I feel that I could also play a huge part in doing that because with the platform that I've been given, I can also help 
other people like me that want to reach their goals.